All right, this is the last problem. A salesperson has two job offers. Company A offers them a weekly salary of $400, plus they'll pay them commission of 10% of whatever sales they make. Company B also offers them a weekly salary, but it's of $800. And then they also give them an additional commission but of only 5% of sales. So the question is, what is the amount of sales above which company A's offer is the better of the two? So we are looking for where company A is better, which means they would offer them more money, would be greater than the money. So when will the money you earn with company A be greater than the money you earn with company B? Now, okay, company A. Company A offers a weekly salary of $400 plus commission of 10% on sales. So I'm going to have to let X equal my sales. Okay. So for company A, it's going to be $400 plus 10% of the sales. 10% would be 0.10, and they're going to multiply that times the sales that you make. So if you were to make, I don't know, if you made $1,000 worth of sales, and you multiply that times 0.10, that would be an extra $100. So then you'd make $500, okay? Now that's, that's company A. <sighs> I told it to change it to a black pen. Why is it not changing? Black. There we go. All right, company B. I'm feeling green this time. Company B offers a weekly salary of $800, but they'll only give you 5% of your sales. So it's $800 plus 5%, that'd be 0 0.05, and sales is still X. It doesn't matter which company you're with, the red one or the blue one, the pink one or the green one. <laughs> I need to have my eyes checked. <laughs> it's going to be X either way. Oh my God, I'm tired. <laughs> and that's my equation. So... Solve for X to figure out the amount of sales so that company A would be better than company B. Okay. So, you know, I'm going to do a two for one special here. I'm going to get all my X's on the left. So I'm going to subtract this uh, 0 0.05 X from both sides. So it'll cancel out over here. But because I want my X's over here on the left, I don't want this 400, so I'll subtract the 400 from both sides as well. And that'll cancel it out over here. Okay, so on the left, I'm gonna do it all in black at this point, <laughs> 0.10X minus 0.05X would be a 0.05X greater than 800 minus 400 is 400. And now your last step is to get rid of the 0.05. Since 0.05 is multiplied onto x, I will turn around and divide it by 0.05. And what you do to one side, you got to do to the other. And of course, anything over itself just cancels out to be 1, and it's 1x. Well, 1x is just an x is greater than, and when I take 400 and divide it by 0 0.05, I get 8,000. So what is the amount of sales above which company A's offer? Okay, you'd have to have sales over $8,000. So if you're trying to make this decision, <laughs> it's like, okay, this is a week. I have to sell $8,000 worth of merchandise 
a week. So what kind of job do you have? Are you working at Kohl's selling clothes? Because, uh, yeah, I ain't going to be selling $8,000 worth of clothes a week. Probably not. But if I'm selling a used car, I might be able to sell a used car a week that's maybe worth nine or $10,000. I might be able to do that. If, but if I don't think I can make 8000 over a week, I would go with Company B. You know, how good are my sales? Because at least there I know I'm going to get, I'm guaranteed $800 a week. And that's pretty damn good, actually, for a week, huh? So, anyway, that's the answer. And that's the end of the review. So, happy studying. And good luck on the test.